here. <coughs> Christianity came to Ethiopia in the fourth century mm -hmm. and received no outside influence for many years due to its geographical isolation. Yes. Its musical and gesture practice does appear to reflect ancestral Christian rites. Yes. What well, you understand by that? That is the ancestral Christian rites. Christian right. Mm -hmm. That is the originality. And the tradition. And the traditional of the custom of Ethiopia and, and its people. And Christianity. And Christianity. Well, it's, eh? it's musical and just of practices. Mm -hmm. That's how they do their music. Yes. Thus appear to reflect ancestral Christian rites. Mm -hmm. All right. The Ethiopian Orthodox Church is a monophysite church. Mm -hmm. It considered that Christ has only one nature. The divine nature which absorbs the human nature. Yes. We oh, understand by that. That is the divine nature now mm -hmm. absorb the human nature. Mm -hmm. So it's the divine nature rule the human nature. Yes. And not the human nature rule the divine. Exactly. Juju. Exactly. Juju. It shared these castological, which means academic studies of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. These with the Coptic Church under whose supervision it remained until 1959. Yes. The Ethiopian Orthodox Church have, no, have self growing mm -hmm. since 1959 yes. and is now led by the Patriarch. Mm -hmm. So from 1959, the Coptic was no longer there. No. From 1959, come down to the Ethiopian Orthodox Church. Yes. So that was the time when his majesty nationalized it yes from coptic to orthodox right Naturally. that's historically correct yes. and it's led by the patriarch yes that is the abuna the highest ranking the highest ranking right Future. orthodox christianity is the major religion in present-day ethiopia yes including slightly more than half of the population Orthodox Christians are found mostly in the north of the country on the nor northern high plateaus. The art of Ethiopia, Christianity was introduced via the kingdom of Aksum. Yes. Historically, it corresponds to the northern part of, 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 of Ethiopia er, and Eritrea. Mm -hmm. The religious music of the Ethiopian church is designated by the generic term Zeme, according to the legend, Saint Yared discovered. So Saint Yared mm -hmm. discovered the, 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 the music yes. of the church. Yes. But Saint Yared is 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 Yared is 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 is, is um uh, what we call now Hebrew. Mm -hmm. So in our English it would be Jared. Jared. Uh, y A E R E D. Mm -hmm. No. But in our English would have pronounced as Jared, J A R E D. Yes. A Kagi translation of Ethiopia to, 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 to the Amari. To, from, uh, yeah, to English. Yes, yes. Right? Yeah. So, with the inspiration of the Holy Spirit, that I was Jared doing, you know, yeah, he's a saint. Yeah. He said, Three birds from the Garden of Eden guided Saint Jared to the heavenly Jerusalem, where the chants or the songs of the church were revealed to him. He never come to him over. Mm -hmm. hmm? oh. Eventually, J Jerusalem. Yes, it's a three birds from the Garden of Eden. Mm, three birds. Three birds mm -hmm. guided Saint Jared to the heavenly Jerusalem, mm -hmm. where the chants were revealed mm -hmm. to him. Yeah. Hmm? He saw twenty-four priests of heaven mm -hmm. dancing, accompanied by the instrument that the Ethiopian church still uses today. Yes. For Ethiopian Christians, which is a part of Zeme, which is the real which is the chance, yeah. it is an accurate reproduction of the dance and the music of heaven taught by the people by Saint Jared. The music of heaven. Mm -hmm. So the Ethiopian chants mm -hmm. and then dance is the music of heaven. Mm -hmm. Saint Jared is an important saint of the Ethiopian priests and cantors. The entire Ethiopian liturgy is sung in unison. With the exception of the scriptures which are read. Yes. The chants are sung in 
in Giz, mm -hmm. a Semitic language from Agzum, which is now used only in Ethiopian Christian church. Yes. The chant is in Giz. So if you don't know Giz, you can't. You're not going to know what they're saying about. So you have to translate now from Giz to Amharic. Yes. But the church don't sing in Amharic. No, sing in Giz. In Giz. Like when now the, the, the priest now yes. start to, like when they come a parish yes, church, yes. and then they go, mm, yes. and they censor the incense. Yes, and command. Yes, and then, mm, mm, the utterance is geese. Yes, in geese. But it's a heavenly language. Yes. So the, the entire Ethiopian liturgy, you know, what they sing in the church in the Unisian, mm -hmm. with the exception of the Christ, scriptures. Which are red, says only the scriptures are red. Yes. Everything else is a chant. True, true, true. So it's not, it's so, you would there, a pure chant. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You understand me? Liturgical chants of Ethiopian church involves long prayers now. Mm -hmm. You know, short prayers? No, long, long prayer. prayers. Long prayers. The pieces, the pieces are built on the principle of text repetition, mm -hmm. often sung very slow. And with rich or or ornamentation, we must take the time to listen to the pieces. All the way through, through is, is order to hear the whole text and to follow the development of the chant, yeah. which becomes more intense and fervent as it goes on. You understand? Yeah. When God is praised, this is always doing important ceremonies where a beautiful idea. Like, when you're doing the chant, you have to have a beautiful and dignified posture. Mm -hmm. You can't stand up any o, mm -hmm. you can't shape any o, mm -hmm. which means standing for, for the Ethiopians. Yes. It is not such much a dance in the stress sense, but above all an idea of, of stature in the ethnological sense of the word. From the Latin stare to stand means it. The stand is to stand yeah. while the movements can appear as a choreographics during in which the participants change places yeah. and are often relatively simple and static. So the interchange spaces mm -hmm. move side to side, mm -hmm. around, you know. Yeah. The cantors move the top half of their bodies back and forth in a rocking motion, mm -hmm. moving their arms from right to left. Yeah or playing a musical instrument so that it becomes a dance instrument yeah. like the lower half of the body remains immobile yes. so you have to practice it you know mm -hmm. you can't jump 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 mm -hmm. all over the place no you're wrapping your body mm -hmm. to the chant to the chant yes, yes. To the chant. To the chant. and it's a much different thing from what we do mm -hmm. not true yeah but you're breaking a jump this way jump this way all over the place yes but this now you're rocking your body yeah. Music, yes. Chant, yes. Chant, yes. Yes. So it's like you're standing and not moving. Yes. But you're right. still moving. You're still moving. Alright. All right. All right. All right. The instruments used are the sistrum, the drum and the prayer stick. So we don't use no buffing. Mm -hmm. The drum and, and the, the prayer stick. stick. We don't use a prayer stick in there. Mm -hmm. It's like Ethiopia. Mm -hmm. Right? which provides purely rhythmic accomp accompaniment. The prayer stick is an Amharic term with the uh, etymology as the word. It serves as a support for the cantors who remain standing through the ceremonies. Olin mm -hmm. is a part of noble appearance. Yes. So it is made of wood, or the, or, 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 or the thing made now, made of wood with a head of ivory Wood or metal, iron, copper, silver or gold, which represent, which is, which is horn shape, the head of a lamb, the symbol of Christ. Mm -hmm. The overall shape invokes Christ's cross. Mm -hmm. So all you go get rid of Christianity. No, that the is whole a, thing is around Christ's yeah, cross. Yes, yeah, that is a prayer, that high prayer stick. stick. Yes. Symbolizing Christ's cross. Mm -hmm. As it used and play. Jobs. You see me? Do you think this is very important? Yes, very important. Yes. This is the only instrument allowed during Lent. The system or, or, or has a wood of horn or metal hanger toppled by a trapezoid, trapezoid frame 
made of oriented work iron, copper, silver or gold. Two thin metal bars horizontally connect to lateral uprights. They each support metal loops or squares which strike each other on a bump against sides of the trape trapezoid with the canter's shape. Canter's and canter's and shape, mm -hmm. you know, and, and use this, this, this instrument yes. to perform mm -hmm. with their hands. There are five small metal loops or squares representing five mysteries of Ethiopian Orthodox religion. Yes. The Holy Trinity, the Holy Incarnation, the Holy Baptism, the Holy Eucharist, and the Holy Resurrection. Mm -hmm. The five mysteries of the church, you know. One, mm -hmm. the, Holy, the Holy Trinity, Trinity. the Holy Incarnation, Nation. the Holy Baptism, mm -hmm. the Holy Eucharist, yes. or Eucharist mm -hmm. and the Holy Resurrection. That is five mysteries. Mystery. So, so everything go round yes and all of them holy true 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 no un ungodly things eh? no them are you understand me so according to some inform informants the sound of the chant symbolizes the sound of the wings of the cherubims and cherubims now yes. that saint jared heard in heaven symbolize Attachment to the instrument often used to a later interpretation, however, the Ethiopians interpret the shape of the sonary of the syndrome from a Christian standpoint, although the instrument exists in Egypt yes. at the time of the pharaohs. Mm -hmm. So they copy the instrument mm -hmm. from the time of the pharaohs yeah. and bring it over to Ethiopia and still use it today. Right? What they are saying, only men are allowed to perform the service. Mm -hmm. They are dressed in white. Some are professionals, others are students of, lit of liturgical chanting. Yes. So no woman don't practice. Perform. Don't perform that. No. No, it's just man. Only men are allowed to perform yes. the services. The services, yes. They are dressed in white. Mm -hmm. Some are professionals, mm -hmm. others are students of liturgical chanting. Yes. So they are professional students who mm -hmm. chant. True, true. You know, they chant, you know, the geese. Mm -hmm. So any or anybody mm -hmm. can perform that. So you have to know the gears. You have to know the gears. You have to know the, gears. Right. You have to know the chants. Mm -hmm. You have to know the routine. Yeah. So you can't just pick up and say you want to chant. Mm -hmm. It don't work like mm -hmm. that. It don't work like that. Right? They said, depending on the particular celebration, for example, we have a different text, but with performance and, mis and musical consonants. The musical practice, as it follows, the chanters sing a given text in several successive versions that correspond to the same number of musical categories. Yes. So it, the chants go with the music. music. Hmm? Mm -hmm. The melody, rhythm, instrumental accompaniment and, and gestures vary from one category to the other. Yeah. So it depends on who is running the chants. Yes. The movements vary. Mm -hmm. Everything coordinates in one niche. In one niche. So, you know, have you know, have unlike what we do, man, are real different, different chants mm -hmm. and no mm -hmm. order, no de de. Mm -hmm. We understand in a work like that. Mm -hmm. eh? So let me let me let me, let me read one of the chants then. Hallelujah, O house of the Lord, yes. be sanctified and stand up, powerful, because there, here is our King. He has come to illuminate you with his power. In the beginning, the father built this house. Yes. The son continued to build this house mm -hmm. and the Holy Spirit finished it. Yes. So that is, a, you, that is a trinity. Yes. The tree in one. Yes. yes. You say, Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Our house of the Lord be sanctified, right. you know. Right. Your blessing. Mm -hmm. Be sanctified and stand up, yes. powerful, because here is our king. Yes. He has come to illuminate you with his power. Yes. In the beginning, the father built this house. Mm -hmm. The son continued to build this house, yes. and the Holy Spirit finished it. Three. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, the powerful. Yeah, man, they try you. Mm -hmm. Three in one. Yeah. 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 So these things are very important mm -hmm. because how we see things today. We don't see a general blessing for what we do, you know. No. No. Is it things that work? Mm -hmm. But there is no prayer mm -hmm. that govern from a leadership of the house. Yes, and you need that. You need that. To guide what yes. we do. Yes. As a guideline. You know, see, mm -hmm. because our house of the Lord, you know, be sanctified. Naturally. So it's a blessing, you know, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. of sanctification Creation. and purification. Yes. Not that true. we should abide. Not That's all. So who will give the blessing amongst I and I when we get up? Well, one may call up. Mm -hmm. One call up on. Yes. To bless the house. Yes. All right. Like how to call up on, you know. And said, Bongo is a, say a prayer. Mm -hmm. And we say a blessed prayer. Mm -hmm. To bless the house, mm -hmm. the congregation, mm -hmm. with the fear of the Almighty mm -hmm. Jah Rastafari. Mm -hmm. And we move along. But that is good. But in case you are not there, Bongo Isa. Yes. What happened? Well. Can you have a priest? No. So we supposed to have a priest in the congregation. At all times. At all times. You have more than um, one, one priest, but you have a leading priest. Yes. That lead the congregation in that sanctification. And blessing. And blessing of the divine house. And, the, and, and the knowledge must be known. That the father built this house, mm -hmm. and the son continued, you know, yes. to build this house. Yes. You can't separate the son, you know. No. From the father. You know. No, for the son and the father. Yes. With the spirit, with the spirit. is one. Yeah. So that is the true, the Trinity, there. Because the son never leave the work undone, you know. No. He continue. He continue as well. So when we look and say, how do we regard the Son of the Almighty? People are quarreling and are made fuss and not even identify him. No. Alright. So the Son would symbolize the Christ? Yes. Alright. The Father would symbolize, which you would call Yahweh. Or Jehovah. Or Jehovah. Yes. See? Alright. And the, 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 the Trinity then. Yeah, yes. So within the Trinity now, would symbolize the mother? Yes. And one would say that's how the people, the, yes. the right there you now, the, 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 the spirit, mm -hmm. the divine spirit. Yes. He said, this house, you know, mm -hmm. the son built it, you know. Yes. The father created, you know, mm -hmm. the son built it. And the son built it. And the Holy Spirit completed, complete it. Finalized the whole yes, thing. Yes, so it's the Holy Spirit now. Yes. Take over and finish everything. Everything. Yes. That's but, yes, so you have, you have that Holy Spirit you know. within you. Within you, yeah. You can't acquire enough for something, 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 something. No, something. you are chasing away this Holy yes. Spirit, man. Yes. So what we say? There's another prayer. Mm -hmm. Protect me, O oh Lord, from the evil man. Yes. The sinner and the liar. Mm -hmm. Because you said, O oh Lord, come back to me. I remember the covenant I made with Noah, my servant. Yes. You also said, I sent Jonas to Nineveh to spread the good word to them. Mm -hmm. So they fasted and prayed and returned to God. Yes. God had, sp had spoken. He who has fasted, prayed, and, and beseeched, he will be rewarded in the truth. Mm -hmm. See? Yeah. He who has fasted, fasted. prayed, and beseeched, you know, mm -hmm. will get rewarded in truth. In truth. That means you must have your fast. And you must pray. And you have your prayer. And you must be seated for forgiveness. Yes. Yes, sir. Naturally. And that does three things all the time. Naturally. It's the power of three. Yeah. Yes, that yeah. symbolizes yeah. the triune. Yes. Two. So when you look on Ethiopian Orthodoxy, right here you try to look on it. Yes. Because when we look on that, and we, and we say, God knowledge coming up on God. Yes. We never know about these things until we start to read about them. Mm -hmm. That's true. If I don't, you don't practice a month or No, and nobody. We talk about orthodoxy. People quarrel and fuss. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
So you don't get a chance to know or to discuss anything around what the Ethiopian Orthodox Church do? No, no. You run away from mm -hmm. it and, and, and try to shun you when you bring mm -hmm. up that topic. Yes. They don't love to hear it. They don't love to hear ah. it. God oh, bless. So, so what we look on, we look on the old, the old. You know, this newspaper is full of big read. Should I read my congregation? Yes, I should read my congregation. That's a great edification. Enough things, Bongo. Yeah. Enough things. They say the gestures are highly codified mm. to evoke the passion of Christ mm -hmm. according to the Ethiopian context. So when the chanters are chanting at this, mm -hmm. it evokes the passion of Christ. Yes, yes, yes. Is that not important? No, what do you mean? So if you're doing so chants, yes. and the presence of the Almighty not there, you know what I'm called? What's the word? So the passion of Christ that it invokes there, yes. is the mercy yes. of Christ. Yes. Yes. Not true. Uh, that him come you know that him come Yes, to deliver us to his mercy. So, you have to chant now mm -hmm. to invoke his presence. Yes. Yes. And you have to do a dance to invoke him like yes. he did. Yes. So, the chanting now to invoke the presence. Like you have to go up with him hymns there. In the geese. In the geese. And, you know, meanwhile like they are chanting this, this, these hymns with the spirit uplifting. Uplift. And your no, body so moving. Yes. You know, so you are invoking the presence of the Christ. Yes. In the congregation. Yes. You understand? Yes. You yes. yes. fully understand it? Yes. You see me? Yeah. All right. There's another one I'll read. I think it's fine. Okay. The servant of the Father, who is full of strength, yes. say to the ungodly flesh, which is weak, mm -hmm. I prefer to die than succumb to your grip. What happened? I'll read it again. The servant of the Father, yes. who is full of strength, yes. says to the ungodly flesh, mm -hmm. which is weak, yes. I prefer to die than to succumb to your grip. Mm. Where get from that? You say no, the spirit of the Father. The servant of the Father. The servant of the Father. Who is full of strength, you know? Who is full of strength. Say unto the ungodly flesh, mm -hmm. which yeah, is yeah. weak. Yes. Because the, the, flesh. the servant of ah, look, look how he comes here. The servant of the Father is full of strength. Mm -hmm. The ungodly flesh is weak. Be, yes. What him say? I prefer to die mm -hmm. than to succumb to your grip. That means I prefer dead man come to the weak flesh and the... the weak, yeah, mm -hmm. to, 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 to the weak flesh. Yeah, to the weak flesh. For the weak flesh, he don't have any grip. Of a corruption. A corruption. Mm -hmm. So when we, when we yield to this temptation and this corruption, mm -hmm. we're not going to know it. No, no. We don't go in confusion. And when you go in that confusion, no. The Holy Spirit flee. You know, must flee. The congregation. Because we have to know to be a servant of the rest of our life. We must be strong. Yes, we must be strong. We must be strong. And we cannot yield the temptation of the flesh. No, no, for healing is Which is weak? Yes. Yes. You can't go into weakness. Mm -mm. You have to leap on the strength. Naturally. So, what we're saying, what we're reasoning, Summarize anything. The Ethiopian Orthodox Church in what they do. Yes. It's important to yes. know. Yes, the correct way. Yes, and not to condemn it because we no. can't condemn what we don't know. No, no. We don't try to learn. Yes, you have to learn. And be patient. Mm -hmm. And research. True, true, true. And share knowledge. Yes, share the knowledge. Because among I and I mm. is not shared. No. People don't know. No. You don't try to learn. No, because them try to fit up your heart at that. Ah, time. And it. Okay. Ah, time. But if you bring up in the congregation, every man after you come with a head, they don't want you nothing about your heart at that. No. And it's our, it's our own fullness. It's our own church. It's our ancient church. We cannot hide from it. And we have to know what they do. Naturally. And the meaning of all their worship. Yes. yes. Or the practice. Yes. <laughs> but this was the originality of it. 
It don't change. change. No, no, and it cannot change. Right, and, and, and what we have to know, you say the Yarel get a vision yes. of heavenly chance. True, true. We still exist today. No, true. So, if the tree does show him what to do and how to mm -hmm. chant and how to write him mm -hmm. thing, how can we go against it? No, and the tree does would symbolize the Trinity. Yes. Which is the triune. Yes. Yes. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, you could say the Holy Mother. Yes. For the church symbolize the woman. Yes. Hmm? Yeah. We can't, we, 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 we can't go around these things. No. no. We can't go around these things no. and go and say, we don't want to learn. No. Yeah.